Speaking of love, Andy, your current bachelorette, there's rumors flying around that she may not be oh. getting married because her boyfriend cheated on her. <gasps> Do you know any wait, scandal to she that? She was just pregnant. <laughs> so wait, she's not pregnant. Wait, she is pregnant or, or not? And Can now you she's set the re record straight for me? <sighs> okay. She is pregnant. It's my child. And Andy cheated with me, which made her boyfriend angry. I see. Um, no, first of all, she still has two boyfriends in Josh and Nick. So I feel like everyone's getting a little ahead of themselves with the pregnancy and the cheating rumors. Speaking of cheating, your favorite Juan Pablo. <laughs> He's yes. another one that's in the headlines today. I saw today. that. He was uh, making out with somebody in uh, Atlantic City. Classy. So you don't think he and Nikki found love? I don't know. Well, he, I see, I think <laughs> that's the whole point of contention. I think they did find love. I just think for some reason he won't say it. But I, I think, I, I really do think they're still together. I don't know for sure. Um, oddly enough, we don't barbecue a lot together. Um, but I, from last I heard, they were still together and they were actually doing well. So Chris, you're not busy enough with a bachelor or bachelorette. Now you've got Bachelor in Paradise. I needed a third primetime network show. You and Tom Bergeron. Who? <laughs> Who's this Bergeron guy people keep talking about with all his Emmys? Seriously, why, why Bachelor in Paradise? Um, we loved Bachelor Pad, but there was something kind of inherently wrong with it. Um, you know, we wanted to do an all-star edition of our show, and that's where Pad came from. But the game show element kind of tainted it and, and made it a little, I don't know, off the Bachelor and Bachelorette brand of, of what our show is based on. And that's just the sincerity of finding love. And so Bachelor in Paradise is just about your favorites coming back and finding love, having a second chance at it anyway. And, and the trappings and the train wrecks and the fires that come along the way. And it is phenomenal. It's, I think it's the best show we've produced. I really do. It's, it's incredible.